So I participate in the program to protect our livelihood and our natural resources on the farm. My name is David Turner and we're in Dinwiddie County, Virginia on my, on my farm, uh, Turner Family Farms. I work with my brother and my father uh, to do tobacco, soybeans, wheat, corn, and, and straw. We have had this farm since 1960. We've gone from 18 acres up to 2,800 acres in the course of 64 years. So we use chemicals on the farm for crop production um, from herbicides, insecticides, fungicides. And then after we get finished, we triple rinse them, collect everything, and we'll take them to the landfill and they get out of our, our hair. It's a waste on the, on the farm. It's a good place to take our, our bottles and it's also the correct way to dispose of the bottles. So it's, it makes it easier on our farm. Mike Parrish at the extension for Dinwiddie uh, came to us and explained the process and the pesticide bottle collection is right down our, our avenue. So behind me is our recycling center for uh, the plastic pesticide containers. The program here in Dinwiddie has been going on for uh, 30 years. My name is Mike Parrish. I'm a senior agriculture extension agent here in Dinwiddie County. We recycle plastic pesticide containers, working with the program with the Virginia Department of Agriculture. We average at this site somewhere around nine to 10. We've had up to 12,000, two and a half jugs that they have recycled. And we recycle on average of maybe 30 or 40, 30 gallon drums through this program. So if you're interested in, in recycling your plastic containers, you can contact VDEX or go to their website to get more details, or you can contact your local extension office once the containers are collected, the plastic is processed into recycled resin, which can be used to manufacture numerous items, including utility conduit, pallets, and landscape edging. Since the program began in 1993, VDAX, in partnership with the agricultural community, has recycled more than 2.4 million pounds of plastic pesticide containers. Thank you for your continued support.